Perl mud commit description for commit C3F1277. This is a work in progress, and in reviewing the commit for this video, I realized I probably don't need most of this because I'm only going to do a search uh, of the of the top level items within a container. I'm not sure how this will work with a character because some of their top level items will be say like their arms and their legs, but maybe it'll just say they have you know if uh, it doesn't have to be uh, humanoid. Um, things, characters, so if it's a spider you might need to know what kind of limbs it has and then you can search those limbs and of course I'm planning on only searching things that are immobile so it has to be dead or bound for you to search it so that I don't have to worry about you know if you try and search it and it attacks you and then you gotta kill off the search processes or whatever. So in Earl Mud character I changed this a bunch in a bunch of places so that you would get the owner and in most places we just ignore it so that I could check if the owner was in the hierarchy and I'm not sure quite at this point how that was supposed to work uh, but now we don't need the hierarchy, and I had just previously fixed the hierarchy and the test for that, and now I can just throw that away. And what else we got? Uh, so I was also working on... Oh, here was send description, so once the search succeeds, you get each of the uh, objects that have been found to print out their description within a certain context. So like, um, you find in the, say, room, this, and it'll describe itself. And what else we got? So taking out the uh, the previous uh, some of the previous stuff for um, TTLs, so we don't need paths anymore. We just need room, and actually I can take out limit as well. And then I thought I had fixed this previously. So before we had proxy and undefined. Yeah, I had. I thought I had um, undid this earlier. Oh no, yeah, I had gone to um, a limit before, and now I'm going back to just using the room. Uh, I'm just going to go uh, up to up to uh, one room away from the original room, and then not going farther. And let's see, doo -doo -doo. Um, here, uh, here I actually took this out and I had to put it in later um, because I need to be able to add uh, properties that have lists of PIDs rather than just adding properties that are a PID. So that if you have, uh, say, several behaviors under the key behavior or behaviors, uh, it'll pick up all of those. Otherwise, if you have an attack behavior, say, um, that attack behavior won't be added to the list of processes that need to handle a message. And Earl Mud Search, I just cleaned that up a little bit. It was going to be a set of, um, it was going to wrangle all the processes that were going out and doing the searches and I guess collecting the responses, and I don't think I'm going to use that anymore. And let's see, and that was it for that commit.